you want to go to views toolbars make sure that your controllers and surfaces tab is showing and then close out and that's this bar here you should see your list listed here if you don't go to options MIDI devices make sure your advanced 61 is checked in the in and the out then you want to go to controller surfaces and if you don't see your advanced 61 already listed here you want to hit this button here add new controller surface and there you should see your advanced 61 listed click it and then click OK and then close then you want to go back up to that panel that you enabled the controller surfaces panel and click the properties key here on the first on the left and there you'll see a page where you can choose a bank and buttons what I've done is set them up in the order of the list that they are on the keyboard the advance itself to fix it you want to say options and say bank one button one and go through the list and find transport play and then in control as you see transport play is bank one button one and do the same for button two make it transport record button three make it transport stop button four make it transport loop and auto shuttle then back in controllers you're gonna hit transport play MIDI learn and then hit the play button on your advance and you'll see this disappear. I'm going to hit it right now. I just hit the play button on my advanced keyboard. So hit the record on the bottom here. Do MIDI learn and then hit the record key on your advanced keyboard and do that for the next two and then you'll see I'm going to hit the play key on my advanced keyboard right now and there you see Cakewalk is responding to the Akai Advance and it's only about a minute setup. Then what you want to do is click up here, type something, and click save. And then you can go back to that easily because it'll be here in your drop down list. Now you've got your own homemade sonar advance link. Get back to work. Get back to work.